how to change the styling of the Elementor comment section for free like this. As you can see, this is just a normal blog post where I have changed the styling. This is how it looks from scratch. And here is another example of how you can style it if you want. In this example, I've just changed the corners a little bit and down here, the website field, I have actually removed it here. So there is only three fields and here is four fields. Okay, so there is actually two ways to do this. Um, here I have just made it completely from scratch so I can show you how I did this. So the first method is really quick and easy and the other one is how to do this manually. Navigate to pages and then all pages. And then you can just go ahead and edit with Elementor. It doesn't matter which one it is. So inside here, as you can see, this is our blog post. We can't change the styling. So what we will do is just go ahead and search for the widget HTML. I will place the HTML widget down here and I will just copy this code, which I will leave in the description below of this video. I copy it here and insert it here. And as you can see, now the entire comment section has changed. Let's go ahead and watch how it looks in the live version. Here, now it's looking like the final result I just showed you in the beginning. So if you want to remove this field, for example, you will go ahead and uh, find the code again and just copy this one down below and insert it in the bottom of the code. Then I'll click updates and see the result. And when I refresh here, it should be removed. All right, so now there's only three fields. Okay, so this was uh, method number one. Let me go ahead and show you how you can do this manually if you don't like to use CSS. So I will just go ahead and delete the HTML widget and just go inside the site settings. And here you will have to find, for example, form fields. And as you can see, if I change the color here, the color of the comment section will also change. So I can actually change all the styling inside here. And if I go back to the form field, and for example, the label size font, I can also change that. If I go back to the buttons and change the color of the button, you can see this is also possible from here. Okay, so now let's try to build the final result. I will just change the border radius to 100 and change the color to white and just remove this border with just set it to zero. I will go back to the form fields and change the color background of this. If I can find the color, I think I want to use the color uh, from uh, the blog post, which is up here. I just click on it and copy this hex code and just insert it. Okay, so now I change this to zero and the border radius to 100 and click update. Okay, let's go back and refresh. So now I have done this manually and it almost looked like the final result. I hope this helped you and please leave a comment if you have any questions. Bye.